everybody and thanks for stopping by the studio today so I could show you some really cool new things that we that just came in. These are our totally organized totes and there are two different sizes. There's the little guy the junior and the big guy the senior. They come in this beautiful raspberry pink and it has a white with silver fleck side on it and they also come in this um, black and this has kind of a metallic flake in it as well so perfect for girls who love pink um, perfect for people who don't love pink but also great in the garage or in the car so some dual purpose um, items here so let me show you first so this is the junior okay now both the large the senior and the junior are double-sided so they open from both sides one side is totally open, so this is eight and a half by 11 on this side, just a big open area. The other side has different segments in it, and they come with uh, li the little grid panels so you can segment them off even further. So this little guy has um, some built-in segments, and then the little grid panels, eight of those you get with that. So four small and four that are a little bit larger, so you can divide that up any way you like. So this is so easy if you're crafty, you're looking at this going, oh my gosh, that's a perfect tote for all kinds of craft supplies. But it also works great for a number of other things. So I filled one of these little guys um, on the segment inside with all the cords for my camera, my iPad, my phone, my laptop, all of those things that kind of just get in a disarray that you can't find. So at home, I put all the cords in one side, and on the big open side, I put all the owner's manuals that went along with the cords. And I've got some pictures of that. You're going to see them at the end of the video. So but it was a great little tool for that. The other thing I did at home was I used one of these for a first aid kit. And again, it was perfect. I was able to segment off all the band-aids and um, tape and all the little gels and the wet wipes and all that stuff in the segment inside. And on the other side, I was able to put the big like um, wrap bandages and the sling and that booklet that comes with your first aid kit that tells you how to administer first aid. So that all fit perfectly in here. So besides just being a super crafty little case, it's going to work for so many different things. And um, if you have a girl in your life who's crazy about hair bows and hair ribbons and that kind of thing, this is a perfect tote for her to fill it up with all her little hair goodies and keep them all nice and neat and contained, especially if she's going to a slumber party and she wants to take those things with her. But all kinds of stuff, art supplies, pens, pencils, that type of thing, it's a perfect tool for that. So if you have a boy instead of a girl who's got lots of little tiny toys, little cars and trucks and that type of thing, or wants to take a bunch of Legos somewhere with them, then the black um, tote is going to be perfect for that as well. So that's the junior. So it is um, 9 by 11, so kind of your standard paper size. It has the handle. They both have um, dual sides that open up. So the junior. This is the senior, and the senior is 13 by 13. And what does that mean, ladies? That means that anything you want to move around that's 12 by 12 in your new pink plastic case is going to fit in there with no problem. So again, obviously you can move all kinds of craft supplies around inside this case. You're going to be able to fit inks and chalks and pens. The big open side is the perfect place for tools and that kind of stuff when you're going to a crop. The segment inside, again, it has one segment that's permanent here. The center is permanent and then these um, center sections pull out. So you can reconfigure that to fit whatever you want um, on this this these little eight segments right here so any kind of craft supplies obviously are going to go in there uh, glitter glues stand up in there with no problem any kinds of tools and then this is just a big open 13 by 13 space so it's obviously going to fit pages in progress or page kits or paper paper packs anything like that each side is three inches deep. Now on the little guy, each side is two inches deep. So this is four inches thick and the big guy six inches thick. Um, so obviously, right, easy for craft supplies. But what I really love this for, so many things, the first thing I love it for is for picnic supplies. So I filled one on the big open side. I put in cups and plates and napkins 
and wet naps and all kinds of goodies like that on the open side. And then on the segmented side, I put in just basic things that you need in a picnic. Salt, pepper, hamburger seasoning. In the big open area right here, I was able to fit some basic, um, like a spatula, a big knife, a uh, wine opener, <laughs> those kind of things. And then in the little segments, the different silverware, napkins, I put wet naps in there, and I also put a garbage bag in there and some Ziploc bags. So now I've got this picnic pack already in the garage. It's just right on the shelf. So if we're going on a picnic, I can just pull that off the shelf and throw it in the car. I don't have to constantly be trying to round those things up that you might need for a picnic. So a great little picnic pack for that. If you're looking for a perfect Christmas gift for one of your girlfriends, especially if you live somewhere where it's sunny and you might get to picnic all the time, filling one of these cases with everything she needs for a um, picnic might be a great gift for her. But it also, again, is going to work great on one side. You can put curling irons and hair brushes and flat irons. And on the segmented side, you could fill it with all your ribbons and hair bows and those kind of things. So a great way to store that stuff. Obviously, especially for the black one, um, the segment inside is going to hold nails and screws and any kind of fastener, while the other side is going to hold a bunch of basic tools. So if you're like me, I live in a two-story house. The garage is on the second and on the bottom floor. So I just keep one of these full with the tools in it and the basic fasteners that I need to like hang a picture or a wrench, a screwdriver, just basic tools, and it just fit really nicely into the linen closet. So if I just need to fix something quickly, I don't have to run all the way downstairs. I put a pair of eyeglasses in too, because you know, once you cross that 40 line, you're always looking for glasses. So I put a pair of glasses in there too, so if I had to fix something, I didn't have to look for my glasses as well, so a little bit goofy. But also, because this is 13 by 13, you're going to be able to fit that 11 and a half inch Barbie doll in here and all her clothes and shoes and goodies on the other side. So if you have a child that's really into Barbies and likes to take them with her, this is a, another great Christmas gift, you know, to fill with new Barbies or Barbie clothes or just to give it empty and so she can fill it up with that. Now, couple other great uses for this and again you're going to see some pictures kind of at the end of the video and they're also all on our website but um let's see i said tools i said picnic i said barbie um but what were the other things that i was thinking of that this would be a really great tool for and now i'm just drawing a blank is <laughs> What a goofball I am. So, um, and I said craft supplies, right? And first aid kit, we put in the little guy. What else would go in this big guy? I can't remember, but I know you'll come up with tons of really great ideas because you're a creative group of people. So, again, the um, senior, double-sided, 13 by 13, uh, six inches wide, segmented on one side, Big empty space on the other side, um, both sides open, heavy duty plastic, so you can put really heavy stuff in there and you're going to be in good shape. So that's the senior. And then the junior, again, both in pink and black, um, segmented on one side, open on the other side. Again, just a real sturdy thing. Oh, I remember the other thing that I thought this is really great for, road trip right? If you're going to go on a road trip with your kids, you can load up all of those little road trip games, coloring books, all that kind of stuff on one side, put art supplies on the other side, and then the kids can use this just on their lap like a lap desk, desk with all the stuff inside. So kind of double duty, but it is more durable, so you're not going to beat it up too bad. Unlike a backpack that you might Filled with stuff that kids have to dig through and search for things. Everything's really visible, really accessible, and it has that bonus of being um, a lap desk while you're on your road trip. So with the holiday seasons right around the corner, we make lots of road trips to grandma's house and visiting friends and family, so it might be a great time to pick up one of these for your son or the pink and sparkly one for your daughter. Fill it with great things for on the road. They're going to love you for it. And you'll love the peace and quiet in a car for it. So thanks so much for stopping by to learn about our new cases, the junior and the senior. Please visit our website to get more information. 
And if you have other great ideas about how to use these two products, we would love to hear from you. Um, even if you just tell us or if you have pictures, we would love to see pictures too. It makes it so easy for everybody else to get the best use out of their products when they have the most ideas. So thanks again for dropping by. It was wonderful to chat with you today. And hopefully I'll see you on our website. Take care.